In this video, I'm going to teach you how to add the Rockstar Launcher to Steam. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Adding the Rockstar Launcher and any other games that you own through the launcher itself on Steam is extremely simple. The reason why you might want to do this is to make sure that you can make usage of Steam Input, which is a feature available through the Steam Launcher that automatically sets up any controllers that you are trying to use. But with all of that talk out of the way, in order to do this process, go over to the Steam Launcher, access your library, and you, if you look at the bottom left corner of the screen, you will be able to choose the option to add a game. After you click Add a Game, there will be three options and you have to select the first one, Add a non-Steam Game. This is going to scan your computer for any compatible games or .exe files that can be added to your Steam library. In here, you can look for Rockstar Launcher or Just Launcher and see if it appears. As you can see, for me, it is available right here. However, if you don't see the Rockstar Launcher right away, all that you have to do instead is click over here on Browse, and this will open the File Explorer. Now, follow this default path. Of course, if you configured your Rockstar Games Launcher installation differently, then it might not be on this specific folder, but the default installation folder is going to be your C drive, program files, Rockstar Games, and then the launcher folder. In here, you will have plenty of executable files, but to my knowledge, the only one that you must add is this one, launcher.exe. You will see that it is the biggest one in size. I've also noticed that for some reason, I also have this Rockstar Games launcher that can be added. I would recommend adding both, but as you can see, the second one, Rockstar Games Launcher, is in Program Files x86. I don't know if there is a big difference between both, but as long as you add the standard launcher, you will be good to go. So click the option to add the selected programs, and now you will be able to run the Rockstar Games Launcher directly through Steam to make usage of Steam Input, the Steam Overlay, and other features available in there. I hope I was able to help you on how to add Rockstar Launcher to Steam. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.